place 30 ml of cyclohexane in the center of a 250 ml beaker full of ice. Next, put a thermometer inside the tube until the temperature has dropped to 10 degrees Celsius. Once the temperature reaches 10 degrees Celsius, start sampling and record the temperature for every 30 seconds until the crystal begins to appear. For first step, weigh 0 0.5 gram of anon solid as a solute into a small dry test tube by using electronic balance. Zero point nine one five is the total mass of the waking paper and the anon solid. Step two. Place the test tube of free cyclohexane into a beaker of boiling water. Then, put a thermometer inside the test tube. Step 3. Once the solvent melts, Remove the thermometer from the test tube and add solute sample into the solvent. After the solute melts, stir the solution gently with the thermometer. Step 4. Let the solution cool at room temperature for about 5 minutes. Step 5. Place the tube into a 250 ml of beaker full of ice and put a thermometer inside the tube. Wait until the temperature has dropped to 10 degrees Celsius. Once the temperature reached 10 degrees Celsius, Start centering and record the temperature for every 30 seconds until the crystal begins to appear. Assalamualaikum and hi to everyone. My name is Aini. So, today I would like to talk about the objective of this experiment. Okay then, there are two objectives which are the first one to determine the freezing point of a pure solvent and a solution of an unknown. Next, to determine the molar mass of the unknown solid using freezing point depression method. So, based on the objective, you can conclude that this experiment could help us to determine the freezing point. Besides, the molar mass of unknown solid can be easily determined by using freezing point depression method. That's all for today. Thank you for watching guys. Bye.